Hmm. You know, I never knew know how to start these videos. It's a lot harder to do commentary videos now that I think of it. When honestly, you don't know what you're gonna say half the time. Which is fine with me. I mean. In all fairness, I feel like this is more genuine than if I scripted anything. So, I'm okay with it. I might, it when that new road plates come in, put them in the back areas first. Put, install the ones in this area, this long line first, and then go down this route. See how far, how much, how many copies I need before. I mean, I think since it's gonna span like two plates, do two um, 16 plates, it might be easier to calculate. I mean, this would be one full or, uh, or copy or set. This one will be one full. So one, two, two, three, and then maybe an odd one there at the end, but still. And then one one looping here, one here, and one here. So one, two, three, th three and a half for the back end, I think. <clears throat> and then one, so three and a half, so maybe six sets. So six sets of the twenty dollar roads this would work. I could take out the the base plate plates for the these because honestly it won't matter in the long run because I'd have to buy like a few of these just to just to add more and that would cost more money I think in the long run. I wonder, so, trying to be more active in the LEGO uh, video community, or as a, in the community as a whole, but, also like, to go into the anime community as well. Mm. I also like anime too, so that seems like a interesting way to go about. I mean, some channels just focus on just I don't know Lego or or sometimes Funko Pops like this, but I feel like. I want to be a renaissance type of channel because if I just focus on Lego it just seems like a waste might of people times if they come for Lego but also see like, things like this in some videos I also like some music I have to say that some music um, just is me in a way. <clears throat> so, hmm. I have to admit though, Call of Duty used to be really good. I mean, 
I feel like this was the pinnacle of a good World War or two game. I mean, this was more realistic than, mm, let's say, for instance, World War Two, Call of Duty World War Two. I mean, you felt the atrocities on both sides. You didn't feel like one was completely good or completely bad. You knew from the perspectives of the combatants. Really wish, though, their Alive 6, 7 will come out sometime soon, I hope. Probably never gonna happen, but if it does, that would be amazing. Also, I feel like Mandalorian and the child's Grugu story arc was really done well. I mean, it felt like they were doing a father or, or son type of thing where Mandalorian actually felt a connection to someone besides himself. So that was a really good storytelling, I say. Also got this from GameStop at a lower price and it was supposedly, it was like 25% off. So yeah, that was good. Cannot wait in, in, until the $30 Mandalorian set comes out. That would be amazing. That's going to be the first time I get a child, the child minifigure. I wonder how much they cost on Bricklink. Hmm. So. I'm curious, how many people actually watch these videos and think, man, this guy is boring as hell. I mean, I don't want to be boring, but I don't want to be that person that says, oh, boo, 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 me. I mean, I don't deserve anyone's sympathy. My dumb mis mistakes are my own. Mm -hmm. Honestly, 32 years of existence and half of the stupid stuff I do is back looking back on should be on me on me. I mean, I feel like half the things I do are just poorly planned out anyway. Or or something stupid happens and I you feel like I should play the victim but oh no oh well I mean maybe there were some times when I might have not should have paid attention to certain things but who knows honestly I've done some stupid things in my past But yeah. So there's that. Let's see. How can I end this video? Hmm. How should I end this video? Oh yes. Um. Please like, comment, and subscribe for her more relaxed content and I will catch you on if I could focus on the flip side <laughs>